Hi friends, today is Saturday. It's a long weekend. So we decided to visit the beauty, the beauty of nature that in the west side of India, that is the Konkan area. In Konkan, we are going to visit the safest beach or most importantly, it's the pure, most peaceful beach. That is the Karde beach. This Karde beach is one of the famous beaches in Dapoli area. For, go, for going to Dapoli and then Karde, where we have three routes from Pune. The first one goes through Lonavla, Khandara, Pali and then Manga. The second one is from Murshi, Tamini and Manga. The last route is via Bod Mahad, Mahad route. Actually, both routes are good, but we, cho but we choose our journey with the route of the uh, Moshi, Tamini, Mah uh, Mangao and Mahad and then the Pali. So let's go. Now we are at Moshi. Moshi is also famous tourist, uh, tourist junction and famous for its dam and mountain, mountains. This Moshi dam is established on Mura river. This water from the dam is used for, for irrigation as well as producing electricity and Bira hydroelectric power plant which is operated by Tata Power. In, uh, in recent years, Moshi and adjoining areas have been developed as a tourist destination and best visit time to Moshi is from August to October when the dam is filled with its full capacity. Moshi, we reached at Tamini Ghat area. This Ghat is a mountain passage located between Moshi and Tamini villages. Tamini Ghat is situated on the crest of Western Ghat mountain ranges. Tamini Ghat is noted for, in, for its surrounding scenic waterfalls, lakes and dense wood. The Tamini Ghat cuts the Sayadri range to join Moshi to Tamini. And make and makes the route in Kokan from Pune. This ghat stretched uh, almost 15 kilometers. The road is now is now very good and newly laid. The entire the entire stretch becomes a popular destination during monsoons. This ghat contains different kinds of green valley carpets, gushing streams, dark grey clouds, stopping low, and the occasional waterfalls.
सो फ्रेंड्स आफ्टर लॉन्ग ड्राइव अराउंड फोर हंड्रेड किलोमीटर्स एंड आफ्टर नाइन आवर्स जर्नी फ्रॉम संगमनेर वी फाइनली रीच एट मुरुड मुरुड बीच ऑफ दापोली एंड देन वी मूव टूवर्ड्स आर फाइनल डेस्टिनेशन दैट इज करडे विलेज करडे बीच इज वन ऑफ द मोस्ट नियरेस्ट बीचेस टू दापोली Actually it is one of the unexplored beaches yet which gives you that silence and privacy one needs less noise and more uh, more of seashore and wave so- wave sound a perfect a perfect destination to relax and rejuvenate uh, rejuvenate black and white sa- sand mixture makes it shine with the sun rays falling on it a unique experience to catch this is a place which makes it more special as it makes uh, you reunite with yourself with beautiful nature so friends now we are going to the karde beach let's go this beach has many specialities like the sand in this beach is a mixture of black sand and the white sand that's why the the water is looking so nice because of its shininess uh if you all know karde is a village that is 12 km far from dapoli this is the beach of karde This beach is famous for its privacy and safety. This be uh, the length of uh, length and uh, length of this beach is 4 km. Uh, as uh, you all can see. This beach is also connected to the Murud beach and the Harne beach. Here we can see my sister is playing there. Friends, this beautiful beach is uh, one uh, is twelve kilometers far from Dapoli. You have to firstly reach Dapoli to come to this uh, beach or to the village Karde. The this uh, uh, this beach is nearly two hundred kilometers from Mumbai and two uh, hundred kilometers from Pune. The distance from both the cities is same. Uh, the distance from the main district of here, Ratnagiri, is uh, is one. Uh, is 132 km uh, the distance from panji goa is uh, 380 uh, 380 km
you can see my sister and mother are playing there they are my sister is enjoying too much at this beach my mother is helping her to get water for uh, for making her uh, sand home uh, here she is working on it uh, like you all can see this all ships are the ships of fishermen they are here for catching the fishes here friends we uh, we are now going to visit the famous lord ganesh temple known as kadevarsa ganpati the uh, the route for uh, lord ganesha temple is very exciting cuz we want to cross the oldest and longest bridge called as khadi bridge this bridge is built on river named jog jog river and backwater of arabian sea the view of this bridge is looking stunning from drone as you can see After crossing the Khadi bridge there is ghat section of 5 to 6 kilometers to reach at Lord Ganesha temple the vast sea to west uh, to the west the anjali village lost in dense coconut groves the far uh, flung jog creek and the twisted road winding down from the mountains climbing steps from the village to the temple and the beautiful temple surrounded by dense trees there aren't enough words to correctly describe this scenic beauty one should admire the vision of the person who thought of establishing the idol of lord ganesha who is the god of art and wisdom in such a suitable and beautiful place The Anjali village is situated on the distance of 18 kilometers on the road from Dapoli to K- to Keshi. While entering the village, you can see the temple of Lord Ganesha situated on a small hill to the right and is popularly known as Kadavarsa Ganpati. The road leading to the temple is engulfed in dense green trees. and there is a straight road for the vehicles that directly lead to the temple it is so believed that the temple was established approximately 600 years ago
The idol of Sri Ganesh is almost 3.5 to 4 feet tall and the figures carved on both sides of the idol are of Sridhi and Siddhi. The precious structure of the temple was all made of wood, but it was later uh, reconstructed in the uh, 1780s. The temp this temple is an excellent example of Peshwa ar architecture. There is must visit place known as Ganpati Chepaut. A pilgrim believes that Ganesha's fo one foot la was landed on edge of the mountain, which headed towards the sea. The view of Arabian Sea from atop is uh, magnificent. The fascinating Swarnadurga fort is located in the sea, about a quarter of a mile off the coast from Hardepur. A rocky island, Swarnadurga is about 8 acres big with stone wall bastions. There is no landing jetty at the Swarnadurga fort. However, the landing in the sea, on the seashore of sandy beach of the rocky island near Harne. It is approximately 30 kilometers away from Dapoli towards north near Anjarli. So now we are going to Murud Beach. It is 5 to 6 kilometers far from Kalde Beach. You can enjoy thrilling water sports activities here such as parasailing, banana boat ride and much more. Horse riding activities are also available here. You can also dig into some local food items like seafood dishes, coconuts and sweet, uh, sweet corn at many eaters uh, that find a place here. The sun, sunrise and sunset of this location are memorizing and make a, and make up for the most picture perfect movement in this destination.
Hacer la prueba.